Hey everybody, welcome back to the Final Fantasy VII Let's Play. We are continuing, or at least trying to finish, our <laughs> visit to Wutai. Yay, Wutai. And uh, to recap, we entered this area because I just want to take a little piss break on the beach. Remember. Everybody does it. Yeah, Remember, right. Wutai clan ain't nothing ain't to mess nothing with. <laughs> yeah, I know. Still your fucking material. <laughs> so we, when we got here, Yuffie ambushed us and stole all of our material. We're not having that shit. Yeah, we're not having that shit. So we're in Wutai. This is Yuffie's home. But the Turks are also here. But more importantly, Don Cornelio. <laughs> Cornelio is here, too. Cor Don Corn Cor Cornelio. Cornelio. Yeah, Don I'm, Cornel I'm just kind of like missing with the names here. But Yuffie has been kidnapped along with Elena of the Turks. Elena. Anyway, Yuffie's been kidnapped. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> T talk to the hand. That's rude. <laughs> <laughs> that is a rude sting when you get down to it. Ah. Oh, yeah, but the, again, our setup for this hey, is you're because on. you have to do this entire quest with no material, so you're, you're just raw dogging this shit. Yeah. So the best uh, course of action, if you're doing it as early as I am, which is disc one, use all those joke weapons that you've got. Because the joke weapons have no material slots, but that's irrelevant because you don't have any new material. And Lunar they also current, have I think really is, good uh, power. Reflect all. Do the joke weapons also have high crit rate? Uh, uh, the nail bat does. The nail bat does. Okay. I thought I actually thought a couple of them. No, Yuffie. I don't know that cave real quick. I'm Listen. thinking of her ultimate. The conformer. Or no, I'm thinking of it. Well, there's well, a cave, we have, but yeah, but there's a. I know what you're talking about. The, the one with the fire. Yeah. Yeah. You drop the plate on a sector, bitch. I know. <laughs> I will take my time. <laughs> you know, I never realized this. What's up? Why does Why does Cloud look like Teen Gohan during the Cell games? Oh, that I saw. I saw that tweet. Yeah. Too. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think it's the reference. It, ah. Like I saw that. I, I I never thought that. It's like son of a bitch. <laughs> It's easier to make the comparison with the overall model. Yeah, right. Because you, know, you lose it, like, obviously, when you like yeah. see the actual model. But, like, I, I, I have no doubt that uh, Cloud's overworld model here was inspired by Team Gohan. Yeah, rest in peace. Cause, yeah, because at the time of recording this, unfortunately, just a couple of days ago, uh, Kira Toriyama passed away. Yeah. And that, uh, that hit me hard, dude. Like, Wait, north, north. Uh, Yeah, but the, but the but this red arrow is pointing down. Yes. Yeah, that's nice. That's south. I can point to the red arrow and go, my God, <laughs> you're not going to go there, are you? I don't know what the fence of the vehicle is. Look at that. Look, a button that you can just click red arrows on to show you where to go. So stop yelling about yellow paint like it's a brand new feature. Yeah, I know. Again, we Wait, should. What? And we have to. We have what to. We, we'll get into that in a second. We have to stress these red arrows and green arrows were yeah. added to the international release. You didn't get these originally in the Japan release. Yeah. And you so, want to know yeah. why? Because people didn't know where to fucking go with some of these layouts. Yeah. So, <laughs> miss me with your yellow paint argument and shit. People are dumb. Wait, <laughs> people they, well, need help. So the well, yellow, no, it's more the like when they, uh, it's more like when the more realistic shit yeah. gets, the harder it is to decide. Absolutely, what you're supposed to jump like, to. like yeah. the more realistic your graphics are gonna get, the more it's going, you're, the more you're asking for folks to realize like what is an interactive object because you don't want someone to just hit smash X on every little thing in the yeah. environment. Yeah. When you're trying to climb like a cliffside or something and some of the rocks are yellow yeah. and that's to let you know oh, that they're the ones right, 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 people right, complain right. about it because they think that it takes away from your exploration. But, fuck but it's like, you. no, it takes away from the pixel hunt of me pressing the exactly. button against the wall along the cliffside hoping that I grab onto one of those. It's like, no, it's like, bro, I, I'd <laughs> rather have the yellow fucking paint. Look, it's not immersive, it's frustrating. Look, <laughs> I get it. It's yellow paint. You don't like it. I got things to do. Yeah. You're saying? <laughs> Look, and I, I got Queen's goes. blood to play. I <laughs> Dude, Cornelia, she's 16. Yeah. You're going to jail, You're going to jail, Cornelio. Cornelio. <laughs> well, yeah. well, we don't exactly know that he was against the whole cloud thing. So. <laughs> <laughs> It's like Cor Corneo. I mean, it's like Corneo. You're not beating the allegations, my guy. I mean, this one's significantly worse. If it has a hole, I'll stick my dick in it. Then settle tell him to go fuck a baby. Don Corholio fucks anything that moves, but that's why he's serving thirty to life. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, he's here just yeah. so he can call this the whole thing the hand job. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, Greg! <laughs> I'm gonna need you to stop talking for like five minutes. <laughs> Just five minutes. I gotta, I gotta let one of those go by. We can't do it here. There are people watching. Who are you talking about? Talk about the statue. <laughs> the fact. I've been through hell since then, and everybody's like, we don't give we a don't fuck. Give a fuck. <laughs> I didn't want to be here. And you being here just makes it even worse. I don't want to be here in Wu-Tai. Why did you kill my, little, you kill my little apps? Yeah, we killed the sewer minotaur. Yeah. I was going to say, like, apps. He like, didn't, appetizers? He, like, didn't, he didn't kill the app. He revoked raps. the license. Raps. Oh, Christ. Oh, no, what if he drops a dope rhyme? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, this is Wu-Tai. 
Oh, you forgot this the George Barrett's the leader of the Wu Tai Clan. Oh uh, yeah, I did. There he is, the Materia Man. <laughs> well, stab the fuck out of him the best you can, because and don't even bother with magic even if you had it. Yeah. He takes very little damage. You got it really high magic defense. All right, all right, who's dying? Arrow three. This I'm is gonna kill the somebody. Aroga three, which is basically the only source of wind magic in the game you had. Jesus! Jesus. Hang in there, Barrett. Look, he's God alive. Damn! <laughs> Hang in there, Barrett. He's alive. We need a mind blow. And and. Well, he already got a limit from it. I was going to say, if he had Fury, he would have gotten a limit. How much MP does the thing have? Uh, d Don't matter. Like, one blast is enough. But I'm going to call it, though. <laughs> What's up? You could all if you had air, Seal Level is another alternative you can use here. I think it is. Oh, Ooh, is. nice shit, nice. Oh, my God. Nice shit. That's did nail he, bat Did he power. crit a limit? Yeah, he crit a limit. Yeah. With the nail bat. I didn't even know you could. So it, like, has a lot yeah, of Yeah, I didn't know, I, the I limits didn't know could you could crit, crit on limits. I thought their, their damage yeah. was static. Oh, no, you got, no. You oh, can crit limits. Oh, you got a peach ring for an item? You ever crit it like fucking like Meteor Rain? That shit's delicious. Yes, it's fucking just... <laughs> yeah. No, Anger Max. Oh, oh my God. That is amazing. You got a peach ring as an item. Why do you think do you a bad feel? guy like me will swallow his pride and plead for his life? Because he's ready to he's die. Ready because to die. he's ready to die. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> the answer is the middle one, but we could, you can say whatever. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Blood rushing to my head. <laughs> I'm so past <laughs> this. Makes me very angry. I fucking love you, man. <laughs> Damn it, Corneo! Release them. This has very strong religious implications. <laughs> and only that, she's 16. <laughs> yeah, I know it's like. Oh, that th that's everyone true. talks about being nailed to the cross. What about being nailed to the cross upside down? <laughs> this double sucks. <laughs> <laughs> on a Japanese god, nonetheless. <laughs> Never. I just realized you forgot to equip the dragoon lance on Sid. No, it's fine. Never mind that he probably did some damage to the like, statue. I forgot to bring his dragoon lance. I got your fam. It just brings up the bat <laughs> with a nail on it. <laughs> but without your dragoon lance, who will save us? Estinian! <laughs> his is your dragoon. <laughs> oh, Rude? Give me five. Rock toss. <laughs> I'm nothing without my Rock pet. toss. I'm, I'm assuming that's what Rude did. He did I, something. Yeah. I figured it was like a throwing knife. Yeah. yeah. I'm nothing without the dragoon lance. If, you, if you're if you nothing without the lance, then you shouldn't have it at all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, maybe he threw like a spare pair of sunglasses. <laughs> that's what I would think. Ooh, he just pulled out another one right cool. there. Yeah. 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 Over, like yeah. What, if he, what if he like threw the sunglasses and then he pulled out another pair and then he just put the new ones on? Hey, Corneo. Oh, wrong. Remember why I said I'll kill you last? What? No, I lied. I lied. Wait, wait, what the? <laughs> Stop it! Ah, <laughs> P. Uh, P. <laughs> For the record, he survived. Wait, does Don? He survives. Cornholio survived? He survives, but he's crippled in a wheelchair and he can't use his dick anymore. Where did you find that out? I think it was like it was a uh, extended universe information. <laughs> he passed. Extended universe oh, info. Oh, so like he the novella and that stuff. He passes yeah. cloud in the live stream. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> they're both on wheelchairs. It doesn't work anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you talking about like the novels and stuff like that? Yeah, something. You know, like, I never yeah. read that novel that followed up the original release of this game. It was like um or on the road to a small. On the road that was like from the that was the Aerith POV. There was uh, Aerith and other thing. people too. Uh Zach is also a thing in there too. And so there's Barrett, Cloud, Tifa. Yeah. Yeah. I uh, never read that. Yeah, it gets literally dying. didn't know it, they exist. I didn't yeah. either. This is before compilation. Like this is before the compilation was officially like made. Yeah. Uh and uh, it, literally it, it was like, it's like I mean, but you know, they do this all the time. Is this like, pre um, Advent Children. Advent Children? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I literally no idea that, that existed. Was it pre Dirge of Cerberus? Every, well, I, I think I said it was pre compilation. Okay. Yeah. So, I think Dirge of Cerberus was the last. Okay. Thing we was got. it? Okay. Was it pre Final Fantasy VII? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here's yes. Okay. Which was I, very weird. I was like, what the hell is this? I, I asked John this already, and, and I already know his answer for it. How would you two feel about a remake of Dirge of Cerberus if it were to happen? No. So no, okay. So. No. I, I have been asked this question before. And yes, by default, I want to say no because just get Dirty Servers away from me. Yeah. At the same time, if they use it as an opportunity to just make it a good game, there's no harm in it. Yeah. yeah. But Your entire plot kicks off by making the planet think it's stupid. Well, here's the, yeah, but here's the thing. The, the, but this is what Matt's getting at. There's more to my hate of Dirty Servers than the game itself. I hate the story. I don't like the characters in it. It is like the whole package. I just don't like the game. Yeah. I think it is a dog shit game. Can you... Now, when we say remake, I'm not talking about a remaster. No. no full... Can you remake it, change up the story, 
so that it flows better. It's not as ridiculous. Maybe there's a reason no, for some you of might as well, You might as well just remake the whole fucking game. But that's what I mean. Even, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. But it, even then, most of the concepts that are introduced within Dirge of Cerberus are dumb shit or dog shit dumb to begin with. So it's like you're just going to be polishing a turd. The only We're, thing I even liked out of anything out of that was the Omega weapon bit. That was it. Other than that, it's like your main plot is basically you're tricking the planet into hurting itself by committing a small scale genocide. That was far less than what Meteor actually did to the planet. And somehow that triggers Omega Weapon to wake up and take the planet away. <laughs> so basically, you have to trick this planet itself into being stupid. Maybe, That's how fucking dumb it is. Maybe Omega Weapon woke up angry because it was daylight savings time. <laughs> oh, by the Did way. Did you think of that? And it lost the uh, hour of sleep. Uh, just quick, just quick uh, to bring up two things here. Oh. The, mu the music cut off again uh, yeah. for some reason. So we're going to have to replace it. And also, uh, you think you have this all more materia back, but she puts every slot, like, available. Oh, Christ. So it's like, ugh, uh, it's all wrong. <laughs> uh, I, okay. <laughs> you know, you know what? I'll do a bad cover of the, of the, of the, of the overall theme that's supposed to be playing. <laughs> Make sure it's not overpowering. Like, I know, you know, I know. Well, you know, I, I, I kind of say that because we, we are going to take a bit of a cut here because I do have to reset up my materia. And, and uh, it's, a uh, uh, and it's, uh, so you will you new. will you switch your weapons back to yes, regular weapons too? Because as much as I do like the, the ones. joke weapons, uh, yeah. Because uh, uh, yeah, you know what? Actually, let's explore you. Let's explore Wu Tai first properly, uh, before we like take a break to. Yeah. Because I'll do that off screen. Why don't, why don't yeah. we try and explore? And then yeah, we'll and then we'll explore, like we'll here. do the. Can you please get out of the way? The, the cat's out of the way now, which means is I can Yuffie's finally house? climb. I cat's out of the bag. No, at least it's Yuffie's garage. Hmm. <laughs> Who put Yoink. a chest up there? This is actually really good material to have HP absorb. HP absorb is amazing. Uh, basically, any material that you have paired with it, when you initiate it, you'll get some HP back. Or, I think it's according to how much damage you did with it. Yes. Or if it levels up, it's like you, for each uh, star master, you get more percentage back on it. Yeah. Uh, if you want guaranteed max heals with it all the time, pair it up with Max of the Round. I like, was going to say, yeah. Max of the Round and <laughs> just <laughs> annihilate everything. All right. Well, this is Yuffie's house. This is what we just left out of. And there's nothing in the bottom level, I don't think. Not anymore, no. Not anymore. Oh, we did get the last Turtle's Paradise Flyer, which means we should get our reward now, because I was pretty adamant on checking all of them. I don't think there's one I missed. I was I was particular on making sure I don't miss the Midgar mm -hmm. ones. I don't know. It's been five years. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, the ones in Midgar are a pain in the ass to reread if you miss it, because you have to get like the whole Sector 5 key card thing yeah. again. Uh, and okay. then there's still one that you can miss easily, and that's Shinra's building, and the Shinra building one. Yeah. I can't get the prize. Yeah. Well, you just got, you this... gotta go to the, the, the square there and talk to him. Someone no. tore this no, not poster you. down. I, I, I didn't want to talk to you. Fucker God. Hey! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure that's what the guy at the bar wants to hear. Like, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't want to talk to you. Or oh, maybe not. Thanks. I'm not sure. Maybe uh, I think I just gotta hover around here. Do you, is it yep. here or there you there go. Go. Okay. So that's not really got live, which is right. Anything happen? Congrats, you found all six flyers at Turtles Paradise. How wonderful. Now here's your prize, just as we promised. Power source, guard Dark source, source magic, magic source. source. Mind. Mind source, Beast. speed source, luck source, mega elixir. Drill! <laughs> <laughs> that mega elixir is really good because we will be duplicating that shit later. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mega elixir, hardly newer. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the weapon, weapon shop. Uh, uh, weapon now. shop. We would do weapon shop now. I this, love Wu Tai's theme, by the way. It's all amazing. These are uh, two link slots and a single one. The Murasame, which is, I mean, actually. You remember you got the joke weapon. We do have the joke weapon. Yeah. So, uh, I, think, I don't know. You think the Murasame is good? I prefer the more different. Doesn't really matter. We have the, we have the Guild of Spare. Yeah, get, uh, yeah. you don't, the only one you don't need to get is the Aurora Rock for obvious reasons. What's the obvious reason? What no one knows. Huh? I don't know. Cool. The Chainsaw is the Barrett's next weapon. Uh, Slash Lance, don't bother with that one. Wait, what's, what's, Wait, hold on. what's the thing with the, the Aurora Winchester? rod? Hold on, yeah. The win <laughs> you get the Winchester. Why? It's like, it's the fucking Winchester. It's a shotgun. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, it's a Winchester. Wait, what's the thing with the rod? Oh, short barrel. It's short barrel, yeah. The rod is Eris' weapon. She's not here, she's is she? She's not here. And uh, spoiler alert, she's never coming back. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> you don't know. We have the tiny Bronco. Maybe when we're swimming around, we'll find a game shark. <laughs> she's, just, <laughs> that's all she's just chilling out in the pure fishing. <laughs> Oh, maybe she's at a cafe having like a latte or something, and then Alfred Sin is gonna see her and nod to her, and then she's gonna nod back, and no one's gonna realize that she's still alive. The oh, Dragoon Lance's Final is Fantasy uh, Four callback, by the way. Yeah. Well, so was uh, Sid's last name. 
uh, said yeah, Highwind. Yeah. Well, I mean, he names the high. Sh- he, well, then he names the airship Highwind, but Highwind's also his last name. But Highwind is also a reference to Kane. Yeah. Well, Sid is a reference to. It, well, Sid's also a reference to all, all things, but yeah, Sid, yeah. this Sid in particular They're, is a reference to Kane. These are these are the constants of life: death, taxes, Sid, and Final and, Fantasy. And Sid and Final Fantasy. Even when Sid so, got old, we had Sydney in fifteen. Although some Sids are hotter than others. <laughs> we were talking about fifteen, yeah, Sydney, yeah, right? Yeah. Yeah. I think. Well, hold on. How old? Oh, so here's the thing. They call they call her Cindy. Sydney, actually. It's Sydney. Sydney. Is oh, Sydney. It's, Sydney. Sydney. No, it's Sydney. No, I thought it was no, no because Sydney. I thought I originally read it. I thought it was I Sydney could, at first. I could have sworn I've seen Cindy, but yeah. I'm pretty sure it's Sydney. Hold on. Because I remember reading that it was Sydney and it was a girl, and I was like, oh, you know, that's actually pretty clever. But then I thought, like in the in the official release, they changed. Oh no, it, it is to, Cindy. It, it's Cindy. It is Cindy. Yeah, okay, it to the fuck. So well, it's like, well, now the charm is gone. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it. it's like you, you fucked it up, guys. Like it should have been just. It was right Cindy. there. Yeah. No, nah, but uh, they no also wonder why Cindy. the director left. Yeah, but there's also. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, but that's that's also a good point. There is also still a regular Sid in. Yeah, 15. there is. Um, He's just old. But still, why, you could, you could have a Sid in a. Sydney. Yeah, you could have done. For it. God's sakes, his first son's name is Mid. Like, <laughs> you can call the girl Sydney. Is he, why would you name your kid Twilight Princess? <laughs> God, the shut f- the fuck <laughs> up. Shut the like fuck up. Someone in the comments like, this, like, I was having a good day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what let's get the f- fuck out of here. Wait, you want your enemy skills too while you're at it, while you're here? Yeah, but oh, hold on. I'm gonna. What I mean to say is that I'm gonna I don't save be here anymore. and we're going to cut as I get my materia back in order because that's boring to watch. Unless you guys want to talk about something. I don't what? Think, it's, so. it's it's exciting. Uh, I have nothing, I have nothing on, interesting gonna, to say. I'm, I'm materia. Oh, then we are going to cut. Exciting and new. Because you can't spell NASA without nah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, man. Here oh, we made we it. Are. Bone village. Bone village. There's a rare enemy here, isn't there? Yeah, the uh, the the, the th- dragon monster. The dragon monster about. that you steal the caramel. There, that's what it's. Yeah, yeah, you okay, just, okay. You just need him for the um. Yeah. For the chocobo breeding stuff. Yeah, yeah. for the for the, one yeah. of the worst things. Only, yeah, I mean, so I can't. I can't. We, well, we're gonna get there because we're gonna be showing it off. Yeah. Of course, oh, but brother. I'm going to be manipulating the value so that we're guaranteed. Like, okay. Okay. Red down with that. Sort of thing. Yeah. No, I've I, done it before. It, it's actually really easy. No, I'm saying I'm done with that. Yeah, yeah. I've done it as much as the black chocobo, but I never got the gold one. Where is the city of ancients? <laughs> the forgotten city. Okay, we didn't actually answer the question. Do you know where? Oops Do you know where Oops is? <laughs> talking about that girl, I wonder, but she went into the sleeping forest anyway. You All can right. also oh, get by uh, new armor here too if you wanted it. Yeah, I'm gonna be real. I forgot you named Aerith. Do do it. Actually, <laughs> yeah, it's, great. it's like a history of the told in the land. Dude, so, wait, yeah. is that another one of Corneo's so monsters? It's not enough to go into the sleeping forest. We actually can't pass the sleeping forest until we play the lunar harp. But the lunar harp is something we have to dig in this area. Uh, I want to buy something though. I I think the lunar harp. <laughs> <laughs> I I think sequences like this are they feel the most video gamey. Yeah. You know, it it there there's no natural flow for you to say, "Oh, by the way, you need the lunar harp," which like what? So, uh we're going to be demonstrating the bone village excavation stuff later when we can get some nifty items. But right now, we're here for plot reason. That's the Lunar Heart. We can, so, all, we can, however, get a few things. We can get a few things, but I'm not really prioritizing those right now. All right. But this is how it works. So you you can hire a team of excavators to dig in a specific position. Well, we're, right now, we're scouting. So what we're going to do is we're going to place one here. It costs 100 gil per member, which, like, I think at the max is five. So it costs, like, 500 gil per... Is it five? Yeah. Yeah. That's not bad. I always did it. At, I think I was just did it at three, just yeah. because of the nature of the game. <laughs> what? Just three members? Well, You're... no, the nature of of this sort of mini game yeah. sequence. Like you only really need three. I was gonna say I thought you were a rule of three kind of guy. A what? A place... rule of three kind of guy. Oh, oh well, I am a rule of three person, but what? Here. Rule of three. Okay. Rule, yeah, works, rule of three. It works well. Yeah. This gameplay is with the rule of three, just by the party members yeah. itself. Two, uh, two, uh, two creates the standard. Three proves the standard. Yeah. You really don't need anything more than that. And this should be our final guy. Uh, and then afterwards, the game is going to tell us where to set off the explosion. Say, ignite the bomb for such. I'm going to blow it up here. Actually, then, you just use the bomb anywhere you want. It don't matter. Yeah. yeah the, the staff members will calculate the tremors and dig up the buried items. The dig point is where the staff's line of vision meets. So all of these guys now are going to turn. 
your treasure is where their lines of sight meet. Mm. So okay. it's here, always here. like around up, here. It's around there, yeah. Is it there? Around here, I want to see. Because her in the southwest is kind yeah, of... Yeah, I always thought it was a little bit left. Like like just under where... Yeah, like right there. literally where you are. <laughs> Matt just gave me the bet. Like, here, idiot. <laughs> <laughs> just... I think there is a bit of a radius, though, you have. You don't have to be precise, yeah. but there is a bit of a radius, though. So we're going to dig here. And then if you're right, after a, a good night's sleep, hope Aerith didn't die, uh, <laughs> we can check the yeah. box. She, she'll be fine. She, she, she'll be fine. Do you get it? Get the box. Lunar heart. Let's go. First try. There we go. Uh, do you want to demonstrate good treasure? At least sure. Once? Yeah. So we, we should always go for like good treasure. Yeah. Normal treasure just to get your potions and shit. Yeah. Good treasure. Good treasure. Good treasure. Also, this helps us stretch the party. Like, <laughs> uh, <laughs> this, this is where we dig up Gunstar Heroes. What, what should, like, same, same as the time, Matt. Like, what, what should we be looking for? Uh, let's try for the bunt line. The what? The bunt line. is a sh It's a golden shotgun for uh, Vincent. It gives okay. him double material growth. Where's, where should I be digging? Uh, it's up the ladder. Number four will be like right around the trees and stuff. Let me see. Say number four. Okay, I see. I mean, if you know the exact spot, you don't even have to order staff. I think you can press circle to, like, cancel that. Yeah, but the only curveball here is, is that sometimes it's not a guarantee that they're going to look in the area you want them to look at. Yeah. Like, they could be finding the item toward, like, the mop or the potion or some stupid shit. Yeah. And what are the other better, uh, like, what are the items? Yeah, what else can we get here, Matt? You get a mop? Yeah. <laughs> Out of context, that sounds really yeah. fucking lame. <laughs> they're, they're all looking at the broom closet. <laughs> you also can get like materia here. That's like a one shot thing if you fuck up. Like Phoenix, Bahamut Zero, and W item later in, in, game. in the areas where you can get materia that are a point of no return. Right. Otherwise, you can dig here so oh, that you don't okay. permanently miss. Now it. that should be that. There is where it is. But now the question is, are they going to point toward the gun? Yeah. If they nope. point towards something else, does that mean and you, you can't dig in the place where you know an item is? Will you get that correct item? I'm positive to say no. Well, we're gonna find out. So we're gonna dig here. Don't listen to us. Huh? Slap nuts. <laughs> I probably would have gotten you to mop. <laughs> now they're finding the gun. Like, oh damn, it, huh. he was right. <laughs> like regrets. Like regrets. There's a fucking gun here. <laughs> Why is there? A gun here? Nothing, Nothing in here. Okay, well, we tried. <laughs> uh, all right, so what we're going to do is we're going to save the game, and then we're ready to reconvene for the Sleeping Forest stuff, because uh, shit's about to get interesting. Oh, no. Are we going to get Are we gonna get to my favorite song in the game? That's what I want oh, to see. Oh, uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll find out, but we'll see you guys next time for more Final Fantasy VII. Have a good night, everybody. Take care. <laughs>